right, welcome back to another Doomsday Kingdom Army unboxing video. A couple weeks ago, you guys remember I unboxed a Part 5 Roy bust that was painted by Jesse Aarons. I screwed up his last name in the other video. I should have asked him how to pronounce it. I was calling it a Hearns. It's Aarons. And um, I also forgot a huge part in that video. I forgot to give a big shout out to the bust maker. Fear of the Dark Studios, awesome bust, awesome paint job by Jesse. Fear of the Dark Studios, Jesse Aarons, awesome stuff. But I needed that part five mask. I wasn't able to get a hold of Camp Jeebus. I know he's really busy with work and I hadn't heard back to him. I was kind of getting worried about, about him, but I did hear back from an awesome mask maker. But I met this guy named Duke Togo. Super cool dude. Told him what I wanted on the part five because he had one done. I just wanted a little bit of shine to it. He's like, yeah, I can do that for you. And he did. I unboxed it. It's pretty badass. You guys, check this shit out. It's good. All right, to our left, we got part four, Jason. To our right, we got part seven, Jason, but enough about them. This is about the man of the hour right now, getting his mask, Mr. Roy Burns. Uh, Roy Burns was painted by Jesse Aarons. I'm saying his name right this time. I made sure I got the last name right. I apologize, Jesse. And the mold that he painted was by Fear of the Dark, studios so check out both of them fear of the dark studios check out jesse he works on all different uh uh molds and paints them and they look awesome just like this one so without further ado i wasn't able to get a hold of camp jeebus love the man he's done both of these masks on each one of these but i went through a guy who had a part five that i thought looked really cool and his name is Duke Togo. So I'm pulling some of this out. And let's see how this looks. Because I told him I want shine. I want it to shine. And I told him not to send me pictures. I already saw the mask painted. I mean, like, is there any way you can shine that up? Make it nice and glossy like Mr. Part 7 over there? He's like, sure. And uh, he, he got back to me and let me know he, he pretty much dug what the shine with the part five so now i'm interested to see what this looks like let's check this out ha <laughs> ha very cool oh he's got a look at it in the wrapper there oh that's bad that's bad man right there i love the part five mask looking good duke looking good let me open this up make sure i don't drop anything out of here That, I packed it perfect, packed it great. We get it out of the plastic. He threw me some cards. I like the cards, man. These cards are pretty sweet. Let me show these off. Deuce, Duke's Choice Hawks. Pretty awesome stuff. Is there anything on the... Oh, we even got that on the back there. Friday 13th, new beginning. Looks like he drew that all out for me. <laughs> That's cool. You dildo. <laughs> All these little things. I'm definitely going to have to look at it more, but here you guys go so you can see it. I think that's awesome, man. Very cool, Duke. Let's take a look at that, though. Huh? Look at that shine. I love it. Very cool. Very cool. I know he's excited to show me. He's like, hope you like it. I'm, I'm sure I will. He even told me he liked it a lot, so... <laughs> Let's check this out, and then we'll play around with some lighting and and see how it looks on Roy Bust right now. So give me a second. I'll be right back. All right. All right, all right. I am definitely digging it. I love these. These look so good in the right lighting. I play around with it a little bit. Duke, I'm really digging the mask, man. It looks really awesome on this bust. It looks really good. I think that's... Those three are pretty sweet looking all together. Part four, part seven, now Roy, part five. I'm really, really happy, Duke. I think it looks really, really good. I love the shine. I almost wish I brought up my uh, 
my Halloween display because that gives like a really cool light. I'm going to set it up behind there. But it still looks cool just playing around with these lights. That's what's so fun about this thing I got here. Best 10 bucks I ever spent just to get this for recording. Get some different lights and different looks. Part six looks like, or seven looks like he's ready to fall backwards, go to sleep. But I, I like to get that idea where the shine is. I really like the shine on all three masks and the right lighting. They look really, really, really good. Um, but I got a ton of content coming up, guys. Um, I'm going to leave Duke's uh, link in the description. Check him out. Talk to him. See what he's got. All these people that I put on, if 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 I don't think their stuff is good, I'm not going to upload it. This is good. All these guys, DSS, who made the two uh, busts in the back. Um Camp Jeebus, who made the two, uh, the part seven and the part, part four, and Duke Togo, who just made this part five for me. Some seriously talented people out there. I love checking them out. Uh, I love seeing their stuff, especially when you get in hand. It's really cool. I got a ton of really cool stuff coming up. I got a series I'm going to be doing on uh, Vinny Cucurato. He's... He's been really cool with me. He's the one who did the pumpkin the pumpkin display, Halloween pumpkin display. I got another display on the way from him. And like I said in another video, or his video, um, he's he, me and him are working on another project that I can't wait for him to do. Um, but I will definitely be checking you out. If you're enjoying the content, like and subscribe. You can check me out on Facebook at Doomsday Kingdom Army. Um, I, I'm trying to get that to grow a little bit, make it more interactive. Um, if you're a mask maker and you're interested in somebody reviewing and checking out your stuff, come talk to me. I'm always down to check out new stuff and buy some new masks uh, to have the content. And until next time, take care, guys. And thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you once again for all the support. I appreciate it.